this is another tragedy. Another rapper gone too soon. When are people going to wake up and realize this life that we are living right here on earth, this flesh, earthly experience that we are having is not forever? When are people going to wake up and realize I am put on this earth for a purpose? Are you going to fulfill that purpose or are you just going to let it pass you by? Anytime somebody dies, it is a tragedy. I don't care who it is, if it's somebody of importance or not. This should let you know that we all are going to die. We're all going to leave this earth physically. These fleshly bodies are not going to go with us in eternity. Anytime somebody dies, it should make you reevaluate your life. Am I living a life pleasing to God? If my life is taken prematurely, where am I going to go after this? Because your soul is going to live on forever. The enemy comes to steal, kill, and destroy. He wants to keep you distracted from the main purpose in life, which is getting your soul connected with the Holy Spirit so you can go from glory to glory, so you can be transformed into Yeshua. We have to stop letting the enemy have so much dominion over us. We have to stop yielding to the things of this world. The devil has glory too. He took Jesus up to the highest part of the mountain. How many times do I have to tell you guys and tell him, if you bow down to me, you can have all of these things. You can have all of the riches and the glory of the world. You can have all these kingdoms. What do you think the people in the entertainment business have? They have Satan's glory. But the thing is, this glory is a falsified glory. It is a mimicked glory. It is a counterfeit glory of God. So Satan wants to give all these people this glory, this earthly glory, this tangible glory that will pass away. But because we don't have biblical truth within us, we're so deceived by the things around us, we of the lust of the eyes, oh, I want this, I want that, we do not care. We are perishing as a whole because of lack of knowledge. We are perishing because people are too lazy to get the work done, to actually build a relationship and study the word of God. We're so distracted by the things of this world. This world is perishing. This world is not going to last forever. We need to refocus. How many more people have to die before you come into the truth? How many more people have to die before you see that this world is not lasting forever? Please come into the truth before it is too late and stop listening to these people.